Hey guys, it's Keely, and today I'm going to be filming a bookshelf tour. This could take a while, so we're going to get on into it, but let me just tell you, all four of my bookshelves that I have right now are all from Walmart, which are very, very cheap, and you may be thinking, that's not good quality, but let me tell you, I have not had a single problem with any of these shelves. They are very sturdy, and I really, really love them, so I will probably buy all my shelves from Walmart, because they are actually like $30, which is so cheap. But yeah, the last time I did a bookshelf tour was May 2015, so now I'm doing another one because I got some more books. So let's get on into it. So this is my first bookshelf, and on top you see we have a little toothless figurine. I absolutely love toothless. And then right next to that toothless, I have a Pop Funko of toothless. And the reason why it's still in the box is because I am going to be moving back to college soon, so I didn't want to lose the box while I was moving. Now onto the books, we have Of Poseidon, Of Triton, and Of Neptune by Anna Banks. These are the three books in the Serena Legacy trilogy. Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children, Hollow City, and Library of Souls by Ransom Riggs. These are all three books in the Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children trilogy. Next to her husband, we have Shatter Me, Unravel Me, Ignite Me, all by Tahana Mafi. These are the three books in the Shatter Me trilogy. But Shiver, Linger, Forever by Maggie Steve Otter. I'm not sure if this is a trilogy because I have seen a fourth book, so I'm not really sure, but these are the first three. All the way to the left there, I have a little figurine from Kung Fu Panda because I love Kung Fu Panda. And then all the way to the right, I keep a little figurine of Iron Man because I love Marvel. So first on the shelf, I have the Maze Runner, the Scorch Trials, the Death Cure, and the Kill Order, all by James Dashner. And this is the Maze Runner trilogy plus the prequel. And then after those, I have another set of the Maze Runner books. I know, why do you have more than one? But I mean, you can never have too many of your favorite books and these are a slightly different edition so I am okay with that. The Adoration of Jenna Fox by Mary E. Pearson. The Kiss of Deception by Mary E. Pearson. The 100 by Cass Morgan. Jacoby by William Ritter. The Clockwork Scarab, The Spirit Glass Charade, and The Chess Queen Enigma by Colleen Gleason and these are the first three books in the Stalker and Holmes series. Daughter of Deep Silence by Carrie Ryan. The Forest of Hands and Teeth by Carrie Ryan. Divergent, Insurgent, Allegiant, and Four by Veronica Roth. Now the next shelf, An Ember in the Ashes by Saba Tahir. Illuminae by Amy Kaufman and Jay Kristoff. The Wrath and the Dawn by Renee Audier. Reboot and Rebel by Amy Tintera, and this is the Reboot duology. Cinder, Scarlet, Cress, and Winter by Marissa Meyer, and this is the Lunar Chronicles series. The Naturals by Jennifer Lynn Barnes, and Talent by Julie Kigawa. And on this shelf, all the way to the right, I have some Star Wars figurines. And I also have a popcorn bucket from the Star Wars Force Awakens movie premiere. So first on the shelf, we have Nearly Gone by El Cosimano. Legend by Marie Lu, Red Rising by Pierce Brown, The Unbecoming of Mara Dyer by Michelle Hodkin, Daughter of Smoke and Bone by Lainey Taylor, Cinderella's Dress and Cinderella's Shoes by Shauna Slayton. These are the first two books in the Cinderella Dress trilogy. Through the Evernight and Into the Still Blue by Veronica Rossi, Asylum by Madeline Rue, Sabriel by Garth Nix, Virals by Kathy Rikes and Brendan Rikes, and Star Wars The Rise of the Empire, which includes two novels, Star Wars Tarkin and Star Wars A New Dawn, and three short stories. Now we're on to my second bookcase, which is a bigger one than the first one. So first of all, here we have this silver tin that goes along with my Infernal Devices trilogy, just because Jim Carstairs, you know how it is. And then next we have this little wooden thing with my name on it that I got at a banquet for my sorority. So first off here we have City of Bones, City of Ashes, City of Glass, City of Fallen Angels, City of Lost Souls, and City of Heavenly Fire, which is all six books in the Mortal Instruments series by Cassandra Clare. 
Clockwork Angel, Clockwork Prince, and Clockwork Princess, all by Cassandra Clare. Lady Midnight by Cassandra Clare. The Bane Chronicles by Cassandra Clare, Sarah Reese Brennan, and Maureen Johnson. The Shadowhunters Codex by Cassandra Clare and Joshua Lewis. The Fifth Wave, The Infinite Sea, and The Last Star by Rick Yancey. Throne of Glass, Crown of Midnight, and Air of Fire. And these are the first three books in the Throne of Glass series by Sarah J. Mass. Now on to the next shelf. You can see I have my Twilight Shrine. So right here I just have some New Moon cards with the characters on them. I have three Twilight pens. And I have this cup from the Breaking Dawn Part 2 premiere. Now onto the books. I have Twilight, the complete illustrated movie companion by Mark Cotavez. Life and Death, which is Twilight Reimagined by Stephanie Meyer, which also includes the 10th anniversary of Twilight edition. The movie edition of Twilight by Stephanie Meyer. Twilight, New Moon, Eclipse, and Breaking Dawn, all by Stephanie Meyer. And The Short Second Life of Brie Tanner by Stephanie Meyer. The movie edition of The Host by Stephanie Meyer. The Coldest Girl in Cold Town by Holly Black. Unwind, Unholy, Unsold, and Undivided by Neil Schusterman, and this is the Unwind Distology. Downsiders by Neil Schusterman. Shadow and Bone, Siege and Storm, and Ruin and Rising by Lee Bardugo, and this is the Grisha Trilogy. And finally, Six of Crows by Lee Bardugo. You can see in my Harry Potter shrine, I have this mirror that says, Have you seen this wizard? And then I have this very beautiful Harry Potter bookmark. The Creature Vault, Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone Illustrated Edition by J.K. Rowling, illustrated by Jim K. The American Hardback Edition of Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone by J.K. Rowling. The UK Edition of Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone by J.K. Rowling, and this is from Bloomsbury. Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets, Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban, Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire, Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix, Harry Potter and the Half-Blood Prince, and Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows, all by J.K. Rowling. Harry, A History by Melissa Anelli. The Tales of Beetle the Bard by J.K. Rowling. Quidditch Through the Ages. Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them. The Cuckoo's Calling by Robert Galbraith, a.k.a. J.K. Rowling. And then over here, all the way on the right, I have a cup from the Hunger Games premiere. Gregor the Overlander, Gregor and the Prophecy of Bane, Gregor and the Curse of the Warm Bloods, Gregor and the Marks of Secret, and Gregor and the Code of Claw by Suzanne Collins. These are all the books in the Overland Chronicles series. The Hunger Games, Catching Fire, Mockingjay, all by Suzanne Collins, and this is the Foil edition. And finally, another edition of The Hunger Games by Suzanne Collins. And on to the next shelf, you can see I have this tin of English breakfast tea. Now on to the books, I have Mythology by Edith Hamilton, The Lightning Thief, The Sea of Monsters, The Titan's Curse, The Battle of the Labyrinth, and The Last Olympian by Rick Riordan, and these are all five books in the Percy Jackson and the Olympians series. The Son of Neptune, The Mark of Athena, the House of Hades, and The Blood of Olympus by Rick Riordan. These are all five books in the Heroes of Olympus series. The Red Pyramid, The Throne of Fire, and The Serpent Shadow by Rick Riordan. These are all three books in the Cain Chronicles trilogy. The Sword of Summer by Rick Riordan, and this is book one in the Magnus Chase and the Gods of Asgard series. The Hidden Oracle by Rick Riordan, and this is book one in the Trials of Apollo series. The Program and the Treatment by Suzanne Young. And a spin-off series of that is The Remedy and the Epidemic by Suzanne Young. H2O and the Storm by Virginia Burgeon. So all the way there on the right, I have a Linus Funko Pop. Now onto the books, I have Vampire Academy, Frostbite, Shadow Kiss, Blood Promise, Spirit Bound, and The Last Sacrifice by Rochelle Mead, and these are all six books in the Vampire Academy series. Bloodlines, The Golden Lily, The Indigo Spell, and Silver Shadows by Rochelle Mead. This is books 1, 2, 3, and 5, I believe, in the Bloodlines series. 
Witch and Wizard, The Gift, and The Fire by James Patterson. These are the first three books in the Witch and Wizard series. Sundays at Tiffany's by James Patterson. Lux Beginnings and Lux Opposition by Jennifer L. Armentrout. This is books 1, 2, and 5 in the Lux series. So now on to the third bookcase, which is also a bigger one. As you can see all the way on the left there, I just have a box, and it's basically just filled with ticket stubs and things like that. Now onto the books, I have The Book Thief by Marcus Zusak, Ready Player One by Ernest Cline, The Martian by Andy Weir, The Running Dream by Wendelin Van Dronen, Between Shades of Grey by Ruta Sepetes, Aristotle and Dante Discover the Secrets of the Universe by Benjamin Elier Sines. Forgive Me Leonard Peacock by Matthew Quick. Winger and Standoff by Andrew Smith. A Hundred Sideways Miles by Andrew Smith. The Invention of Hugo Cabret by Brian Selznick. And You by Caroline Kepnes. Now on to the next shelf, as you can see all the way to the left. I just have this jar and it says Adventure Fund and it's just filled with loose change. Now on to the contemporary books. I have Landline by Rainbow Rowell, Eleanor and Park by Rainbow Rowell, Fangirl by Rainbow Rowell, Since You've Been Gone by Morgan Matson, The Unexpected Everything by Morgan Matson, Second Chance Summer by Morgan Matson, Amy and Rogers Epic Detour by Morgan Matson. My Life Next Door by Huntley Fitzpatrick. What I Thought Was True by Huntley Fitzpatrick. Just Listen by Sarah Dessen. The Truth About Forever by Sarah Dessen. Along for the Ride by Sarah Dessen. What Happened to Goodbye by Sarah Dessen. The Moon and More by Sarah Dessen. Saint Anything by Sarah Dessen. The Statistical Probability of Love at First Sight by Jennifer E. Smith. Anna and the French Kiss by Stephanie Perkins. Meant to Be by Lauren Murill. To All the Boys I've Loved Before and P.S. I Still Love You by Jenny Hahn. And these are the first two books in the To All the Boys I've Loved Before trilogy. The Summer I Turned Pretty, It's Not Summer Without You, and We'll Always Have Summer by Jenny Hahn. And this is the Summer trilogy. Burn for Burn by Jenny Hahn and Shiobon Vivian. And this is book one in the Burn for Burn series. Now on to the next bookshelf. As you can see on the left, I have this Bunny Swarovski crystal thing. And then right in the middle, I just have my stuffed bunny that I've had since I was like six or seven. Now on to the books. I have The Storyteller by Jody Picot. I'll Give You the Sun by Jandy Nelson. Safe Haven by Nicholas Sparks. Something Real by Heather Demetrios. The Brilliant Light of Amber Sunrise by Matthew Crow. The Loose Ends List by Carrie Firestone. Through to You by Emily Hainsworth. If You Find Me by Emily Murdoch. We Were Liars by E. Lockhart. If I Stay and Where She Went by Gail Foreman, and this is the If I Stay duology. Everybody Sees the Ants by A.S. King. Please Ignore Vera Dietz by A.S. King. Where Things Come Back by John Corey Whaley. Me Before You by Jojo Moyes. Happy Face by Stephen Eamon, The Half-Life of Molly Pierce by Katrina Leno, The Lost and Found by Katrina Leno, An ARC copy of The Lost and Found by Katrina Leno, Let It Snow by John Green, Maureen Johnson, and Lauren Miracle, Paper Towns by John Green, Looking for Alaska by John Green, An Abundance of Catherines by John Green, The Fault in Our Stars by John Green, Will Grayson, Will Grayson by John Green and David Levithan. Every Day and Another Day by David Levithan. My True Love Gave to Me 12 Holiday Short Stories, edited by Stephanie Perkins and by a bunch of authors. Now onto the next shelf. As you can see, I have a tin of English Afternoon Tea. Now onto the books, I have The Gospel of Winter by Brendan Keeley. The Way I Used to Be by Amber Smith. Dangerous Girls by Abigail Haas, Memoirs of a Teenage Amnesiac by Gabrielle Zevin, It's Kind of a Funny Story by Ned Vizzini, Cracked by K.M. Walton, Empty by K.M. Walton, 
Trance by Linda Gerber, After by Amy Efa, Rumble by Ellen Hopkins, Identical by Ellen Hopkins, Perfect by Ellen Hopkins, Crank by Ellen Hopkins. Then I have another copy of Crank, Glass, and Fallout by Ellen Hopkins, and this is the Crank Trilogy. Triangles by Ellen Hopkins, Go Ask Alice by Anonymous, Jay's Journal by Anonymous, Letting Anna Go by Anonymous, The Book of David by Anonymous, and Lucy in the Sky by Anonymous. Now on to the last shelf of this bookcase. As you can see straight ahead, I have a Darth Vader Funko Pop. Now on to the books. I have Dorothy Must Die by Danielle Page. Next, I have Gone, Hunger, Lies, Plague, and Light by Michael Grant. And this is the Gone series, except I'm missing book five. Aragon, Eldest, and Brissinger by Christopher Paolini. And these are the first three books in the Inheritance Cycle. Far, Far Away by Tom McNeil, Horns by Joe Hill, Leviathan, Behemoth, and Goliath by Scott Westerfeld, Afterworlds by Scott Westerfeld, and finally, The Most Notorious Crimes in American History. Now onto the next bookcase. This first shelf is more of a classics shelf. First, I have Great Tales of Horror by H.P. Lovecraft, Where the Sidewalk Ends by Shel Silverstein, the Boy in the Striped Pajamas by John Boyne, Charlotte's Web by E.B. White, The Outsiders by S.E. Hinton, Of Mice and Men by John Steinbeck, Lord of the Flies by William Golding, The Perks of Being a Wallflower by Stephen Chbosky, The Empty Grave by Ida Chittam, Anthem by Anne Rand, The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe, Prince Caspian, The Voyage of the Dawn Treader, the Silver Chair, The Horse and His Boy, The Magician's Nephew, and The Last Battle, all by C.S. Lewis. And these are all seven books in the Chronicles of Narnia series, and these are my mom's editions from her childhood. Holes and Small Steps by Lewis Satcher. The Giver, Messenger, and Son by Lois Lowry. Dragon Rider by Cornelia Funk. The Secret Garden by Frances Hodgson Burnett. Peter Pan by J.M. Barry. Alice's Adventures in Wonderland and Through the Looking Glass by Lewis Carroll and Jane Eyre by Charlotte Bronte. Now onto the next shelf. As you can see, I have a more toothless items. I have this little figurine and I have this toothless piggy bank. Now onto the books. I have Noah's Ark, Princess Diaries, Princess in the Spotlight, and Princess in Love by Meg Cabot. And these are the first three books in the Princess Diaries series. Kiss Me Tomorrow by Susan Shreve, Ella Enchanted by Gail Carson Levine, The Secret Language of Girls by Frances O'Rourke Dowell, Love Ruby Lavender by Deborah Wiles, Each Little Bird That Sings by Deborah Wiles, I Heart You, You Haunt Me by Lisa Schroeder, TTYL by Lauren Miracle, Nancy Drew, Girl Detective by Caroline Keene, Zodiac by Robert Graysmith, and A Dangerous Morning by Ann Perry. Now on to the next shelf. As you can see, all the way to the right, I have a little Uncle Cy Funko Pop. And there I have a Fandom of the Month Club subscription box. Now on to the books. I have 90 Minutes in Heaven by Don Piper. Heaven is for Real by Todd Burpo. The Book of Awesome by Neil Pesrica. Unbroken by Laura Hillenbrand, On Death and Dying by Elizabeth Kubler-Ross, The Her Campus Guide to College Life, Tombstones Most Haunted by Joshua Hawley, British English A to Z, This Star Won't Go Out by Esther Earle, Multiple Blessings by John and Kate Gosselin, Live Original by Sadie Robertson, and Grace and Style by Grace Helbig. And finally, onto the very last shelf, I have Falls Like Lightning by Sean Grady, Hush Hush by Becca Fitzpatrick, Fracture by Megan Miranda, The Lovely Bones by Alice Siebold, Me and Earl and the Dying Girl by Jesse Andrews, Warm Bodies by Isaac Marion, 
Under the Blood Red Sun by Graham Salisbury, Beauty Queens by Libba Bray, Gone Girl by Gillian Flynn, Cliffhanger, A Mystery in Mesa Verde National Park by Gloria Skrzynski and Elaine Ferguson, The Fangirl's Guide to the Galaxy by Sam Maggs, The Bad Beginning by Lemony Snicket, and this is book one in A Series of Unfortunate Events, Scott Pilgrim's Precious Little Life, Volume 1 by Brian Lee O'Malley, Saga, Volume 1 by Brian K. Vaughn and Fiona Staples, and finally, The Walking Dead, Volume 1, Days Gone By, by Robert Kirkman and Toni Moore. So that was it for my bookshelf tour. I am exhausted. That took a long time. But anyway, I really hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for sticking around and watching the whole thing. And I will see you next time. Bye!